Chef here now. Is it the final of the Edinburgh Fringe 2011 Comedians Cook-Off already? Yes. We're at restaurant 12 Picardy Place where Chef Mark Greenaway is going to show comedians Nazos Manilow, Jeff Leach and Reagan's Look Real Enough how to cook with this. Comedians are raring to go, and let's see yeah. if we'll be saying well done by the end. What's their beef go. going to taste uh, like, is what I'm saying. Finally, though, last time you were judged by three judges which you, you knew about. This time we've got a special surprise judge. Are you ready to meet your surprise judge? Special judge, enter! You'll know her name. Now you can put a face to it. It's Kate Copstick, ladies and gentlemen. She gave me one stance, though. That's unfair. Show me the yummy. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> <laughs> now, on the basis of your show, I'll be very interested to see if you can do something creative. <laughs> so you don't know, Kate. I'm going to ensure that I stick my dick in the beef before <laughs> I've awesome. probably tasted worse. <laughs> Are we ready, guys? Yeah! So let's get ready to cook up! <laughs> Got ten minutes starting now to slice the beef, cook it, get it prepared, serve it to all the judges that have just met their surprise judge. They are going maniacal in there, and rightly so. This is There's no other way of putting this, this is quite simply sensational. Health and safety means nothing in these parts when you've got funny men cooking food. Nobody wants to lose now. The Woo! pressure is on. The pride is at stake. Everyone's so stretched that we're running around like headless chickens. The art of cooking is relaxed. Like, right. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Don't forget your sauce. That's three, two, one. Serve it. Just put it on the plate. Just put it on the plate. It's time to find out what's their beef going to taste like. We've got the three judges here, and can you talk us through your initial reactions to these presentation-wise? Well, they uh, all look quite nice um, straight away, though obviously a few are um, burned. I mean, if you have a look, that's cremated, and don't know who did that to a lot, but they should be shot. Also, if we have a look over here, I mean, this is almost mooing. Kate Copstick is not happy. What, what's happened there? Quite tired by the time I chewed through it. Oh, no. oh gosh. No, that's horrific. Yeah. I don't know what's happening. There were like two levels of horrificness, yeah. like from, you know, from that, here that to here. Had, that has had its back. taste extracted. It's this seems to have had its original taste extracted and another deeply unpleasant taste added to it. Added to it. Yeah. yeah. I don't understand that's true. how things so wonderfully. Uh, and look at that. Place oh. with truffles and wonderful See, things can good. taste so bad. No. Um, I mean, that's a crime. It's I mean, a crime. He's yeah. just said it's yeah. a yeah. crime about my food. <laughs> a crime. It's illegal. <laughs> my beef <laughs> is illegal. It's on a par. It's on a par with theft. The comedians have been watching as the food's been being tasted, and they know which one's theirs. I'm going to count to three, and after three, if you judges can point to the dish that you think should triumph in this. Okay, we're ready. Okay. After three. One, two, three. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Come on, Cops, we're, we're all right. Always forgiven. Always forgiven, you man. Come on, let's go. <laughs> we're taking a room for the night. We're taking a room for the night. <laughs>